today on your Loose Women Live. It's Colleen Nolan, Brenda Edwards, Linda Robson, and Gloria Honeyford. Hello, and welcome to your Thursday show. Earlier we said we had a big announcement for you, and a certain This Morning presenter is here to tell all. It's only Josie Gibson. Over here, <laughs> they, they, they look like they're having such a good time. Always a spare chair. Oh, yeah, thank you. Well, I'm here now, and I've got a really big announcement. Yes. So. You're pregnant. <laughs> 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 okay, look, not that big. <laughs> um, but um, I, I will be joining you guys on your tour, on your little loose women tour. Oh. So yeah. In a few weeks, actually. Starts in a few weeks. What dates are you joining? So I'll be doing Bath, that is on the 21st of September, and I will be doing Plymouth on the 23rd of September. I just could not let you guys have all that fun without me. No, we're really looking Why fun. would you? Yeah, <laughs> and, and Linda and Gloria, you're going to be there in Bath, aren't you? We yeah. are. So it's not that far away. No, and I tell you what, that is my little hometown. So is I'm, it? yes, yeah, oh, so you've got Bristol in Bath. We'll go out after yeah. the show. I've already, booked, I've drinks. already booked the place. <laughs> okay. That's it. So your family have bought all the tickets, have they? Uh, I'll get him to buy some. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to be really exciting. We've also we've got Larry Lamb, who's coming to a special guest um, in Southend, Wednesday, twenty seventh of September, with myself, Christine, Frankie, and Janet. And we've got Chesney Hawks. Um, he's going to be at Nottingham, uh, Thursday, seventh of September. That's me, Linda, Janet, and Kay. It's going to be good. Oh, I love, love Larry Lamb. He's I such love a Larry. hero, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. Are you excited, happy. Josie? I'm really excited. I always get excited to join you guys. Uh, you know, you just have so much fun. I do get a little bit jealous okay. sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but Actually, we all, we all, of course, remember Sherry Houston, of course, on Loose Women for many, many years. Yeah. It was great fun. Uh, well, she is going to be in Birmingham on Friday the 1st of September and again in Sheffield on Thursday the 14th of September along with Linda and Brenda. So you're doing yep. quite a lot of these. Yeah, we are. Yeah. <laughs> cleaning Some up, say girl. too many. <laughs> <laughs> no, and... <laughs> <laughs> My mate Biggins will be in Manchester with me. I don't know Aww. who else is going to be there, but me and Biggins are going to be there on the 8th of September. Oh, that would oh, be a yeah. good one. Great guests we've got coming yeah. up. Yeah. It. That was great. Yeah. it is amazing. And, and actually, there's loads more guests through the whole tour as well and all the other dates as well. It's all very exciting. And if you want more details about the tour, go to itv.com forward slash Loose Women. Thank you so much, oh. Josie, for coming over. Yeah. Yeah. You there. I, no, I love you guys. I love you. You're, I've always supported every single one of you, and you lot have always supported me. So Aww. I cannot thank you enough for your love. So. Well, you're doing all right, aren't you? Well, I'm not having a bad point. <laughs> 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 good. Can... Right then, on with the show. And uh, here's what we've got for you this lunchtime. As 35-year-old singer Talisa says she prefers old-fashioned courting to dating, we're asking, should marriage always be the end goal when you're looking for love? And from courting to making babies. I've been holding it all morning. What excitement? <sighs> you know what I was thinking? It wouldn't be the worst thing if I was. No. You know, all the things I missed out on when Bex was little. And... Well, as EastEnders, Sonia faces the prospect of becoming a mom in her 40s. Is there still a taboo when it comes to having a baby later in life? Linda has got some news on that front later. Oh, no. <laughs> Bye-bye. Stand up. Stand up. <laughs> also on today's show... A three-year-old boy was killed in a suspected dog attack. A four-year-old girl has died after being attacked by a dog in a family back garden. Sadly, a woman in her 20s was pronounced dead at the scene. Good morning, Britain's Charlotte Hawkins joins us with some shocking details about the rise in dangerous dog attacks. After witnessing an attack herself, Charlotte has a warning for parents everywhere this summer. <laughs> 